Hey folks, welcome back to Board Game Casual. In the last video, I opened up an order from the AEG store, including the Space Base Dreadnought Pack expansion. And I thought I'd do a separate video to take a closer look at the Dreadnought Pack itself. Now, candidly, this is the type of expansion or promo pack that I find myself really liking these days. Rather than adding new modules, mechanics, or rules, this is simply more cards. I think this lists on the AEG site for 10 bucks, and as I mentioned, I ordered this during the Daily Dice Deals promotion, where it was 55% off of that. So a really good price, but also not a lot here. This is just some extra cards. Now, I love Space Base. It's always a hit with anyone I introduce to it. These cards look like they add some fun new variety, so I pulled the trigger during the sale. Let's take a closer look at what's inside. All right, so it comes with 12 cards in total, one card uh, for each number. If we look at the first card here, the number one, I, I really like these cards that give you a reward and let you take the reward of the card next to it. So that's a cool card to add to the mix. So if we look at the number two card, this is what really intrigued me about this pack. This gives you a bonus specifically if you roll a two via snake eyes, via two ones, and then you get a really big uh, uh, reward, and I thought that was pretty cool. I like these cards a lot too. So number three gives you the ability to take the bonus from either the number two card or the bonus from the number four card. So this is a great way to double up on rewards on some, some good cards there. Number four, here's another one of those cases where uh, if you roll exactly double twos, then you can take this bonus and it's a, it's a pretty strong one. Of course, I like that uh, if you deploy this ship, you're making points too. So real nice card there. Here's another one for number five. Wow, if you, if you get a lot of these cards, you can put some engines together that, that uh, you know, really allow you to double up on cards. Here's another one that lets you take the value of either the, uh, the four before it or the six after it. The number six card, again, here we got doubles. So a lot of uh, money or gold uh, if you roll double threes. Let's put this here. The number seven, now these are pretty cool. I like these, uh, uh, these, these cards where uh, you have multiple rewards. So if you hit a seven here, you've got money as well as increasing your income and points. So that's pretty cool. Number eight, another one here where if you're rolling double fours, uh, you're getting a reward, some, some strong income or production. Number nine, another combo card where you get a lot of different awards just for hitting that nine. Number 10, once again, uh, doubles here. So if you roll two fives, you know, it'll be really interesting to see if these types of cord cards are, are worth buying and putting into your, into your uh, tableau. Um, of course, uh, you know, by deploying it, you're making straight points, so that could be really valuable. Let's move these up a bit. Here's the number 11 card. Again, another um, multiple reward card. Of course, you've got to hit an 11, which is pretty tough. And similarly, number 12, again, making it worth your while. If you hit a 12, you get a lot of rewards and a lot of nice rewards if you deploy this ship as well. So there you have it. I hope this video gives you a better idea of what's in the Space Base Dreadnought Pack. I'm really excited to get these in the mix the next time I play and see how they feel. Uh, if you've got these cards and have played with them, let me know what you think in the comments. I'd love to hear from people who've been using these cards and, and, and hear what you guys think uh, when you're playing with them. Hey, thanks so much for watching and to those who've subscribed. It really means a lot to me and the channel. With that, see you next time here on Board Game Casual.